it is stated that the hearts of the unbelievers are sealed but according to science it is the brain that thinks and not the heart your comment please the brother posed a question that the quran says that the unbelievers hearts have been sealed by allah subhanahu wa ta'ala today science tells us it is the brain that thinks and not the heart and i do agree with him so even the quran and scientific when it says that the heart has been sealed and i do agree the quran says that in several places including surah baqarah chapter 2 verse number 7 that allah has sealed the hearts of the kafir people it says that the seal has been put on the hearts if you know the arabic word used here is kalb the Arabic word kalb has got two meanings. One is heart and the other is intelligence. So if you translate correctly, the word says Allah has seen the intelligence of the unbelievers. And it's scientifically proven that intelligence has to be sealed, not the organic heart. But there was a person who once posed me the question, Brother Zakir, I agree with you that kalb means heart as well as intelligence. But one verse in the Quran says, the hearts are behind the breast. Then what do you have to give the answer for that? And he was quoting a verse of the Quran from Surah Hajj, chapter 22, verse number 46, which says that the eyes are not blind. It is the heart which is in the breast which is blind. So Quran says the eyes are not blind. It is the heart which is within the breast which is blind. The science tells us eyes see, heart cannot see. So isn't this verse unscientific? Here the translation has to be heart. It can't be intelligence. So I tell him, I agree with you, the heart has got two translations. But the word used for breast is sadar. Sadar. Sadar also has got two meanings. One is breast and the other is center. You know how we have the head of an institution, we say sadar of, of the institution. Now how we have center, if I've been to Pakistan, how in India we have choke. Over there they have centers. Sadar so and so, Sadar so and so in Pakistan, center so and so. Sadar also means center. So the correct translation is the eyes is not which is blind. It is the intelligence which is within the center which is blind. Same I started my talk by quoting a verse of the Holy Quran from Surah Taha, chapter 20, verse number 25 or 28, which says, Rabbish Rahli Sadri. Oh my Lord, increase my breast for me. This was a dua made by Musa salam when he was asked by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to go and deliver the message to the people. He asked Allah, Oh my Lord, increase my breath for me. See, breast is not the correct translation. What does the breath got to do with the message? It means, Oh my Lord, increase my center for me. And make my task easy for me. And remove the impediment from my speech so that they will understand me. As you know, Musa was a stammerer. And if you know, whether fortunately or unfortunately, even I happen to be a stammerer. In childhood, I was a stammerer. Therefore, at the beginning of every talk, and even the beginning of this talk, I said, and I made dua to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Rabbish Rahali Sadri. Oh my Lord, increase my center for me. I'm asking help from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Increase my center and remove the stuttering in my speech. Even today, when I don't speak on the stage, I yet stutter. It's Allah who helps me out on the stage. Rabbish Rahali Sadri. Oh my Lord, increase my center for me. Make my task easy for me and remove the barrier from my speech and between me and the audience so that they will understand me. Therefore, scientifically, Scientifically, if you analyze the work of Surah Hajj, chapter 22, verse number 46, it says it is not the eyes which are blind. It is the intelligence which is within the center is blind. Because they are not blind, the unbelievers can see. Seeing they are blind is unscientific. Like the Quran says in Surah Baqarah, chapter 2, verse number 18, it says, it says that deaf, dumb, the blind, they will not return to the path. Summum. Bukmun, umyun fahum la yarjiun. The deaf, the dumb, the blind, they will not return the path. It's not talking about physical deaf people. It's talking about unbelievers who are hearing, they cannot hear. Seeing the signs of Allah, they don't accept the Quran. So, Quran is more scientific. It says correctly, they can see, the eyes are not blind. It is the intelligence within the center which is blind.